Dear students, good morning. Today we are going to solve the questions of maths class 4th, exercise number 4.3, page number 101. Let's start. Avneet bought a chocolate worth rupees 72 and a juice worth rupees 35. What amount will Avneet pay to? Shopkeeper. So students, Avneet bought a chocolate for rupees 72. And he bought juice for rupees 35. So students, amount paid to shopkeeper is, is equal to rupees 72 plus rupees 35. When we add rupees 10 to 72 it becomes 82 and then 92 and then 102 at last it becomes 107 so students our right answer is 107 rupees our next question is Supreet bought a school bag worth rupees 365 he gave rupees 500 to shopkeeper how much money will be returned by the shopkeeper students supreet bought a school bag for rupees 365 money gave to shopkeeper is rupees 500 money will be returned by the shopkeeper for this, we will see that he gave rupees 500 to the shopkeeper and bought a school bag for rupees 365. So these rupees 365 will be subtracted from rupees 500. So dear students, when we subtract rupees 365 from rupees 500, then we will get rupees 100. 35. Our next question is Vinod bought a book worth rupees 247.75 copies worth rupees 180.60 and pen worth rupees 35.20 how much did he spend in all? So students, Vinod bought book for rupees 247.75. Expenditure on copies is, is equal to rupees 180.60. And expenditure on pen is, is equal to rupees 35.20 So students, total amount spent by Vinod on all these items are rupees 247.75 plus rupees 180.60 plus rupees 35.20 It means that Vinod had spent Rupees 463.55 on all these items. Our next question is, Tanisha wants to buy a battery car worth Rupees 945 for her brother. She has Rupees 820. How much money does she require? more to buy it so students price of battery car is is equal to 945 tanisha has money is is equal to rupees 820 money she required for this we subtract rupees 820 from rupees 900 45. So dear students, when we subtract rupees 820 
from rupees 945 then we get rupees 125 now it's time for giving some homework dear students you have to solve all these questions of exercise 4.3 on your notebooks thanks everyone